Chin so I yes, can sir. get somebody to look at some cameras and see if we have anything. Very sweet, very cute. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Karen and Andy, obviously. He and her hooked up. Your friend, the yes, one that you went, okay. And we all worked at the same bar together. I didn't meet her. You better tell your story one day to help other people. On October 9th, 2021, officers were dispatched to a kidnapping attempt that had just occurred in the area. The victim sat down with officers to explain what happened, but something was not adding up. See if you can notice what doesn't seem right. Hey, is Amir, you here? Hey, how are you? Are you okay? I'm okay, yes. You need to see medical attention? I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Can you step inside if you want to? Okay, yeah, sorry, it's no, dirty. <laughs> Can you tell me what happened? Yeah, I'll talk to you about it. Uh, so, I was, yeah, I was, I'll see what happened. Uh, So I was walking down, I pulled out down because I'm a test. Oh, I down. Uh, it was hit out very late. She had already gone home. Mm -hmm. We went out together, so I felt bad. So I was like, I go home. I started walking. I tried my other friend, Taylor, and she was at our friend's house. It's all the way over here. I knew I was a little bit too drunk, and so I was like, all right, let me pull over, I guess, whatever, walking, pull over. So I sat there for a minute, mm -hmm. then I called my her and my other friend, and they didn't pick up, and so I was like, all right, I was, and so I called mine, and I was like, hey, I'm all the way home, just expect me in the next couple of minutes, whatever, because it's... They live across the street for a, a thousand faces. Mm -hmm. the, I guess the back way, I don't know. And as soon as I got off the phone there, I hear like the car, obviously. Mm -hmm. uh, but you know, there's like cars, or whatever, and then. It comes like in my peripherals, and I see the front window is mm -hmm. painted white. But I know some companies do that or whatever, so I was New like, oh, whatever, yeah. And then uh, I hear a slide of the door, mm -hmm. and then uh, the arm comes around me, and I didn't get to see like the hand, it was so fast, and it was just a long black long sleeve just like this and I didn't even remember that I pepper sprayed in my purse mm -hmm. I guess it, until I did it and so I like reached over with this hand and I sprayed backwards I didn't hear anything I just ran like absolute hell I ran I don't, I don't even remember mm -hmm. which way I was going, what direction I ran. I, all I knew is I ended up in the lit, like, middle center of the, of the standard over there. Mm -hmm. So it happened the, in that area, in that intersection? Close, I guess, over there because I ran. I mean, I still ran. I, oh, God, I wish I could remember which street No, I'm you on. could. I'm take so your sorry. time. Take your time. Um, was but, anybody else? With you, nobody else was around, nobody's no, saying anything. anything okay. because everybody's out, obviously. Um, I just wanted to come home so I could wake up early. I left early. Uh, I don't remember, I don't remember what street I know. I saw their house from the back because they were. I don't know what the name of that street is. Uh, 
Before you get to the standard? Yes, it, I mean, so the standard's over here, and then this Were you is close to the height at all? The height? I was, I was it Not that. I mean, I was close considering that I could walk there, but not, like. So you was in one of those? Yes, ma'am. I was in one of the, one of the, like the CrossFit. Whatever the. The CrossFit because in the that CrossFit area. CrossFit is right next to Thousand Days. Like, that is right here, and I remember. Mm -hmm. So were you in front of CrossFit? Cross that. Uh, okay. Uh, not on the by the main street. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. No, because I went the back road street because they have a back entrance, and that's where I was trying to see. Uh, uh, yeah, but Taylor lives at the standard, but she was seeing one of our other friends over here. Name, so you you do remember saying CrossFit? When I was running, yes, Sam. So you think like, he was on so the back side by the clap by the hockey? I was, this was the this was the street. Mm -hmm. So this and I is ran the, back and then I started running this. So this right here before I hit the corner is where the car did that, and then I started running straight this way, and then I saw the CrossFit Center and I crossed over this way because I remembered the like. That was obviously close to our house. So you didn't go to the back with the hockey, the no, classic yeah. center? You no, didn't go that way? You came out? The yeah, no. So by. I was like this way and then this way because it was like I saw the the cross center and the house of bases and then I ran that way to get to the corner that I was at next to the light for the standard. Uh, but I didn't see... Um, a skin tone or anything. Mm -hmm. I didn't see like a hand. Did you I didn't say see anything? It. I was just a black because it was just like basically it was like right here. Mm -hmm. It was just a black long sleeve. Did you? Did he and say I, anything when you sprayed I him? Hear, you didn't hear I anything hear when you sprayed anything. him. So you just took off running after no, you sprayed him. No, I, I just ran. Mm -hmm. It was not. I didn't hear. I mean. I know it was a lot happening, but did yeah. you see which way he went, or didn't you didn't see nothing? I didn't see where the car went, because I think it, like, I tried to put that, so it was like a, this, and then I ran that way, because I knew the front of the car was that way, so if I had to guess, the car would have gone that way, which would have Towards been, the classic center? To, yeah. Okay. Um, but... I don't. I didn't look. I would. I just ran. Um, oh my gosh. No, you're fine. Take your time. Um, this just, all happened in like 20. I'm just glad you. Less. I'm glad you reacted. I didn't even. I'm know. glad you. I didn't even, and I don't have the peppers. I mean, I guess it dropped it. I don't know what I did. Mm -hmm. um, and I didn't. What kind of, what does a pepper spray look like? What color is it? Maybe we can it's pink. go back it's and a pink. try to figure um, out where you was at. It's called, uh, my dad's nurse got it for me. It was, a uh, damsel in, what was it called? It's a, it's a cute old name. Um, five, seven, and 35. It was, uh, damsel in defense. That's what it's called. It's a damsel in defense and it's okay. pink. Um, very sweet, very cute. Um, thank <laughs> you, Andy, obviously. Um, and I, she found my eyes her a thank you card, I guess. <laughs> um, but yeah, so, uh, it, it should just be with a little pink tube. But I, I don't even know. Mm -hmm. 
they might never see if it's on the street or anything. Yeah. Keys. Huh? Was it on your keys? No, it's just in my purse. Oh. I so you didn't drop purse. nothing out of these, just the no, purpose no, purse? No, ma'am. Okay. Uh, uh, 27. Yeah, it was, uh... Um, he, yeah, no, or he, or, I honestly don't know if it was, a, if it was he or she, just because, I mean, it was very strong, the arm, mm -hmm. but it wasn't, I mean, from what I saw. Probably my supervisor. Okay. From that. Did you ride down Doherty at all? I did. Since she dropped her pepper spray, maybe we could figure out pink. That's why I was. Uh, okay, just, I just sprayed it back there, so I don't know if it was in there and there being on the street. Or... Right, three, one. Three, Thirty-five to two six more. Can you go back over to Dolly Street in that area and look for a little can of pepper spray? Pink. pink. She remembers seeing the CrossFit gym, so she was in that area when she ran. So when you sprayed him, you ran back out towards. Yeah, no, I remember because he had my this arm was a lot more than this arm because he went this so way. I remember seeing the CrossFit gym, so I imagine somewhere in that area where we were looking. And then I put my this arm in my purse because I have it on the side because I, my parents were always like pick like. People will say first when I was doing a little crossbody. And I reached in and grabbed it. And I sprayed it like this. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I threw it or if I just dropped it or what I did because he, like this arm released a little bit. And so then I just ran the opposite of the, the front of the car. Mm -hmm. Um, but I didn't see, it was a black, it was a black long sleeve, I don't know if it was more than two people, but I know it was at least two people because one person was holding me and the car was still moving. The car was still moving as he was driving. Put my hand in my purse to get mm -hmm. the spray. And somebody was driving. But again, I don't know if it's who's more. Take your time. Take your time. You did good. Just know that you did good. I'm, I'm glad that you was able to react fast like you did. You So you do remember, you know it was a white man to be. A white man? Like, what about windows? They painted over the windows white. So the windows were white as well? On the outside, I don't know about the inside. Is it like a bigger van or a minivan? It's like one of those vans that everybody's like stereotypical. Okay. Like, those are the vans that people get snatched up. Do you see any kind of, like, anything on the top, ladders, anything like that? I see, I mean, I was only inside for like, I wasn't even inside, I was like the front half of my body for a second, mm -hmm. if that makes sense. Uh, because it was just like a, and I tried to keep, but like, it wasn't much of a struggle though, mm -hmm. I guess, because it wasn't moving very fast. Right. And as soon as I got what was going on, I kind of, I don't even know how I remember that I had that, because I didn't even know I had it before we went out, like, but it was, it was, uh, it was like a very, it was quick, but it was slow, mm -hmm. if that makes sense. Like, mm -hmm. he was, or she, I, again, I don't know. It wasn't distinctive in whether it was a man or a woman. But it, it went like this, and the car moved a little bit. 
and I only got, I mean, it, it, it really wasn't quick. And I obviously had enough time to reach and find the, and then spray before I was fully in the car because I didn't get the opportunity to, well, plus, obviously I'm not getting the car willingly, but it was a, I heard the door slide mm -hmm. while I was walking. I didn't see it, but I heard it. And then it was like a wrap around, but I didn't get to see this part. It was so fast, or I just wasn't paying attention, really. But it was a black long sleeve. And then it was a kind of tug, but forceful enough to, I don't know, it almost seemed like, now that I'm thinking about it, it's just like, I'm not a big girl, you know, like mm -hmm. it's very, easy so now that I'm thinking about it with you guys like I don't know and obviously I'm not complaining <laughs> that I wasn't pulled back in the band but I don't really understand why I couldn't have been or I wasn't I guess to an extent I don't know, but all I know is I saw an orb. I don't want to say it looked similar like mine, but it wasn't much bigger. Mm -hmm. It could have been a man or a woman's. And they had a black, it was a black long sleeve. I'm not quite sure there was a turtleneck. I didn't get to see. And they grabbed, it was like this far of my orb. And this one was down. This one was like this. Your arm was down. That's the arm you used to grab the this pepper spray. Because I was typing on this one. Oh, on your phone. Yeah. Are you on your phone still? Yeah. So the only thing you oh. dropped, and the only thing you remember losing was the pepper spray. Yeah, pepper spray is the one I lost. Um. um when you, I'm sorry, I may have missed it, but when you, were you leaving downtown? Like, can you tell me direction of which way you were walking? Yes, sir. Um, so, I, so the last bar I was at was Cutters. And I walked down past 1785, so I walked down Clay and that way. And then I walked past the classic center, but then I took the, the little turn that is right there, if that makes sense. Doherty, yeah. Yeah. where you live. So it was like, classic center is right here, and then mm -hmm. you go this way. Um, so you passed the height? Yes, okay. yes. Um, you turn right off of the, along that like Fukito place. No, because I didn't pass Fukito. I went the. You went before. I went, so it was like the classic center, and then. Oh, there, yeah. 
Because that's where they learn. Yeah. Is bad so I went this way. So it was like alumni cookie, classic center, the classic center, alumni cookie, and then I went this way. Um, and that's where it in two thousand. This places. is where I mm -hmm. called my roommate, and then I kept walking this way to turn back around. Where does the friends live that you were going to visit? Uh, across from a thousand faces, and um, the CrossFit place. Like, to the like left of the CrossFit or right across. across from the... Oh, so a thousand faces across from CrossFit. No. So, so a thousand faces and CrossFit are right next to each other. And then directly across the street. Yeah. Like, and that yeah. big brown brick yeah, yeah. places, yeah. Okay, not yeah. the apartments to the left of the CrossFit place, but no, the apartments no. directly That's, across We have a different kind of house there. Okay, so was the van parked in a parking spot or did it pull up? I didn't see it. That's the thing. So there's a... I knew there was a whole, I visited our friend that lives across from there a lot, yeah. and I knew there was a street that went that way, but there's also like a, a side parking lot that mm -hmm. if you, if you keep going that way, you can turn through, um, and you get to the standard. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I, I went this way and I turned through, because that's where I normally park when I'm visiting, um, so I went this way, and I went that way. Okay, so you turned down was, the street and then went down that little alley? Yes, sir. That's what you're saying? Um, and I was, on the, I was on the left side of the alley because I had to get, I was going to go back to the main street that way. And that's where I heard the, um... Sliding door. Yeah, was when I, was when I, was when I turned that way. So it would have been parked like next to the building of the CrossFit place. Or it would have been or the, um, those apartments. The um, the, road the, right next the to it. It would have was the standard. Or going to the standard, right? Yeah. 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 Well. Well. And that fence—it's a fence right here. Were you near that fence at all? The fence um, on, on, so like this is the thousand face. Are you talking about this fence? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, because that's that's where I turn to get it to that way. Got that Very crisp right now. I don't know why. No, that's okay. So what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to get patient so I can. Get somebody to look at some cameras and see if we have anything. So this is alumni cookie dough. This is a thousand faces CrossFit apartments. This is the CrossFit. This is the CrossFit building. This one. Yep. Okay. So this is the standard. So this is okay. This is the standard. Um, yep. So this is how. So I walked. Sorry. No, that's okay. Um, so the classic center and stuff is right in here. Okay. So I was walking. I walked a different way than than I than I usually did because typically I just walk down Clayton and then walk up there. Um, but you remember walking by the classic center, correct? Or by alumni cookie dough? Alumni cookie dough, yes okay. sir, but so not we, necessarily the classic center. We know 100% that you were at this location. Though. Yes sir. Okay, so, so from this location, from tell here, me where you went. So I went this way, Uh huh. because this is where our friend lives, over okay. here. Yeah. And then, I think I ended up, this is the parking lot where Joseph lives. Yeah, so I don't, you I up? think I went, uh, yeah, because that's where I was confused. It's because I was on the phone with so you, you and then I was on the phone with Taylor. Way, but but I ended up going ran. this way. And so, so I went. I w that's the hockey, is that the hockey rink down there? Uh, yeah. it's like but I don't, remember, I don't remember seeing the hockey rink, but I do remember getting here and not knowing what this T was. I think, and then going, going this way. Okay. 
down Foundry Street. Um, because I, 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 I remember going past like the apartment and calling Taylor. And then I tried to call her again, but I've been walking straight. Yeah. And it turned that way because I knew the standard was that way. Like, even though I had gone past. You just know it's to the left. Yeah. Yeah. So I think, I mean, so I mean. So 100% positive it wasn't that little alley. You'd pass that, correct? And you'd gotten down to Foundry Street. Yeah, I don't think it was. That's the, that's the parking lot, right? They were talking about. Yeah, the parking, yeah there's yeah. a cut through. Yeah, there's a couple parking lots. Yeah, yeah. This. no, yeah, because it's it here and okay. then here. That's where I typically park, so I want to say it was this way just because I was, I was talking. Uh, and then I think I was just going you up this way. You probably ran side. across this grass because you said you did a diagonal. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I, um, I'm sorry, sir. No, um, no, no, don't I apologize. I'm just trying to, um, trying to get a good idea so I have a place I, to start. I know... For, um, Take your time. We have good cameras downtown, so hopefully we can get a yeah, get a van or a tag number or something. Me at 9:30. So this happened after you got the phone yeah, with her. And so this happened between 9:30 and 9:50. Because she called me. And she said she was walking home. I started tracking her. Do you remember seeing anybody kind of look strange? Anybody kind of driving slow? Anybody like they might have been well, watching while you was walking? No, never noticed the van until this incident. So, right so he was probably already in the area and just waiting. Are you, do you live, you live here? Yeah. Okay, you live here. Um, yeah. I, so when we were on the phone, I heard a woman's voice. I don't know who at the 9.30 call. And you said you're trying to get into the building. You needed the code. And then you said there was a call, and you guys were laughing, and then you were like, I'll call you back soon. Like, you're, I'm on my way home, I'll call you back soon. So like, the a couple minute thing. That house? Yeah, when you were outside Taylor's. And then, I waited, and you called me again, completely freaking out from this tangent. And I was like, literally 20 minutes mm -hmm. to the tee. So you ran here. You you walked I did all the way here. Run a red light. Oh, you went and got her. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. you're fine. <laughs> it's that red light by the stairs. Are you sure the windows are blacked out or whited out? They were whited out. Whited out. Painted, all of them. Painted over. Yeah. Painted over. Okay. Yeah. Did they come up? They got you from the left. So I was walking on the left, and they got me from the. So it was like a. Do you remember saying door. you remember saying black window all of the windows are white or uh, I mean the one the one so I saw the I had my per I saw the I saw the the passenger mm -hmm. and that one was white mm -hmm. and the passenger so the window one that slid. okay um so I don't know if all of them were white but it was the it was the one the the passenger because. Yeah, I wasn't, yeah, and, um, yeah. She says she, she does remember the passenger side window being blacked out white. 
white paint over it, not black. What's your telephone number? Mine. Hers. Oh. Hmm. What's your telephone number? Hmm. So after this happened, you call her. Did you call 911 at any time? I didn't. I did. I called, just called her. her and okay. I called my dad. And then my dad told me to call 911. Yeah. Um, they're on their way up here right now. Who are they coming from? In Savannah. Okay. Um, just know that you did the right thing. Don't feel bad about any of this because none of this is your fault. Don't fault yourself for nothing. You did the right thing. You acted fast because some, some girls don't get a chance to act fast like you did. So you did good. You'll be able to tell your story one day to help other people, help other girls like yourself. Up here and that was so scary. Like, yeah. It's okay. Take your time. And if you ever that feel was like the you need. That's what she said on the phone. She called me. She's like, I think I just, like, I almost got it. Not even, I didn't even know the abducted thing. Like, that's, yeah. 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 Are you a student? Yes, ma'am. How long have you been in UGA? Four years. Four years. Yes. It's taken me a victory lap here. No, no, that's just, hey. It's, it's, just, <laughs> it's not a race. Uh, just so good. Uh, so you said when you called, you got, she called you at 930. Yeah. And then, and then how long did y'all stay on the phone? And then nine. 49. Like she was calling you. Two minutes and then one minute. It was very quick. So like 949, 948, 949. 940. I can... Yeah, I can bring it up. Yeah. Uh, was you ever on the phone? You said you was texting. You wasn't talking to anybody else on the phone at the time. Going, I was going to call the girl whose house I was staying outside of. Mm -hmm. And so I went. So I called to buy it. Was that, that 9.31 for a minute? And then 9.49 for you. 9.49 when you called her and told her it happened? Yeah, she, was she, I, was I, 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 I called her at 9.40. And so between 9.30 and... I, I hit the... Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Wait. Yeah. And so did you make it to your friend's house? I, I was there, I was outside. Do you not remember talking to that lady? There, and I had the code. She gave you the code. A lady, it was a lady I there that gave you a code. Yeah, that was the thing. I, I don't remember talking to her. I don't remember getting the code. I don't, I didn't go in. But I left. Is there a reason why you didn't go in? Mm -hmm. Probably because I didn't want to see what I wanted to see originally. Um, if I had to guess, that would be it. Um, which sleeps in between, what is it, 40, you said, called you at 49? It's like nine minutes. 
It's all the time. Literally all the time. I walked up, so I walked, I walked down the stairs. I went down the stairs. And I kept. Yeah, I went down the stairs for the, for the apartment complex. The house went down the stairs. Four stairs. I went down the stairs and thought the faces. I kept walking that way. And I called Taylor again after. And I tried to get into the house. Called her again. Because it was out. Like, basically giving her the opportunity to let her know that you were going to bust in. Yeah. Um, Are you looking for something? I was not looking for anything, but I already found it. I had both their locations. They're both assholes, whatever. Um, they were together at this apartment, at his apartment, and I... Is it an ex? It's whatever you want to call it. I don't even care. Um, you, don't think he, you don't think he would have had nothing to do with no, none of this? No, okay. no, definitely not. Definitely not. Um, but... Just asking, because everything, okay. any kind of it's details yes, yeah, we can yes, get... Is, so he, so he and I, he and her hooked up. Your friend. The yes, one that you went, Okay. And we all worked at the same bar together. I didn't meet her until I had already started hooking up with him because she had an internship across state. Um, we met. I stopped fucking him, basically, because mm-hmm. I was like, oh, I really like this girl. She really likes you. I'm not doing this anymore. Yeah. Um, and she was like, I didn't know that he was hooking up with you, whatever. So I'm going to stop. So when I saw her tonight... We spent the whole day with her, actually. Yeah, she was like, I gotta go home, I'm throwing up. And she wanted to try the location. She was at his apartment. This is his apartment? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Yes, ma'am. So I walked up, called both of them multiple times. Um, Walked up, none of them answered, obviously. Um, He, turns out, is at work. She's just sleeping in his apartment. Crazy. Weird. Uh, um, but she got paid out by someone, so she got paid out by someone, there. so they must have dropped her off mm-hmm. in his apartment. So I was going there to see if she was okay, she basically, because her apartment is right next to his. So, I don't so she stays it. in the standard. I yeah. She yes, in apartment there, I think. So I uh, was up there, and then and you called me. I called you and that lady when I was there. You yelled you at this lady. lady. You said. My ex-boyfriend's in there cheating on me. Okay. This was about 9.30. This was the 9.30 yes, call. Yes, the 9.30 call. And then she gave you the code to go in. And then All you're right. like, but I definitely, I definitely didn't go in. No, so you didn't. I, I didn't go in. She might have given me the code. I didn't go in. I walked down the stairs. Kept walking. Called her. Was this lady acting weird? No? No, ma'am. She okay. seemed, she seemed all right. She, I think she worked at a thousand faces across the street and seen me outside for a little bit. I was just like, but I don't know why she would give me a code. I didn't hear her give me a code though. Because if she would have given me a code that worked, I would have gone inside. So the code didn't work. I don't remember putting a code in though. That's the problem. Is So after you find out that your boyfriend was, your ex-boyfriend wasn't there and you tried the code and you just left? And that's when all this happened. Well, he's, he's, I know his code, his code didn't work. And that's what I remember, is putting in his code and it not work. Me walking away and going down that way and calling her. And so, I called her. What a, what apartment? What's the name of the apartment he stays in? Um, I have no idea. Someone literally so there's like a street in between a thousand bases and that cross the center and then these apartments right here. Okay. Um, there's like three apartments and they have like steps, mm-hmm. like wide, like deep, similar to ours but not concrete. And then they're all black. The steps are black. And then they're like on the there's a 
enough for like a one-way car like parking lot and that loops around the back and they've got dumpsters there and it's gated yeah. and it's concrete and then you can literally go like through there to like strong i think street mm -hmm. where the standard is mm -hmm. and a small one where mm -hmm. there's like metered parking and then the entrance and then yeah and then the, the but that's not the apartments the ones across from those before all like the industrial I think they got your, your information in the call. We got people looking at cameras and all that good stuff right now. So hopefully we can Thank you. find something. Get this creep off the street. Creeps. Hate people. This, I hate people. This I week it happens. This week has been crazy. Never, yeah. ever, ever, ever. We've had things come in threes. And that's all This is the start. We thought it was over. Yeah. Did y'all know the girl yesterday? Yeah. Y'all did. And the one and the one that shot herself. Yeah. And the guy that jumped off. Yeah. Yeah. Guy jumped. yeah. That's crazy. I found out that he jumped, not that he fell. Yeah. Is he okay? I haven't heard anything. He's, he's, oh, yeah, he's my friend's he's, boyfriend. He's fine. But I mean not. Fine. He is. He's good. He's been asking for her. Really? Oh, that's he woke good. up. He woke up. But um What's, what's your name? I'm just going to... What's your last name? What's your date of birth? I think they got all your stuff in the call, I think. Five, seven, seven. Do you have the caller's information in the call? Temple, thank you. I'm gonna see if he's still outside. I think he went to his car. Y'all have any more questions for me? I'm gonna step down, step downstairs, and I think they he's calling the um, detective and all that good stuff. So we'll see where it goes from there, and thank hopefully we can so give y'all some answers yeah. soon. I'm gonna give you a case oh, card. Guys, yeah, I'm gonna give you a case card. Too, I'm and if you ever feel wow, like you I'm need, scared. if you need counseling or anything, feel free to, cause it's probably gonna, gonna be in your mind yeah. for a little while. Yes, ma'am. Just remember, just start walking with in pairs. Don't walk. Yes, it's crazy out here. Which sucks. I've been working in a bar since my freshman year of school, and now is the only time I'm having. It. You weren't even working. I wasn't even working. And it was like nine. Five seconds. What's the last four here? Okay, give you that. And if I have to come come back up, I'll just knock, okay? Yeah. All right. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you so much. Officers reviewed video footage from the downtown cameras. The video shows the victim walking where she said the incident occurred, but all officers saw was her walking calmly in the direction of her home. Officers contacted the victim to set up to meet at the incident location. She agreed, but later left the officer a voicemail stating that she would not be meeting with him due to a prior engagement she had. Officers later went to the crime scene to find any possible evidence. One thing they thought they would find is the pepper spray she claimed to have dropped during the incident. No evidence was found. Officers did speak with the security guard who the victim encountered the night of the incident. He stated that he told the victim to call 911 immediately since this just happened. She refused to do so and told him that she would call when she got back home. Officers received a text from the victim informing them that she has been dealing with some personal things since this incident was reported in the newspaper. The officer replied back stating that they would need to get another statement from her given the serious nature of this report. Officers did speak to the roommate again. She stated that her roommate, a.k.a. the victim, was having some relationship issues with a former boyfriend and another friend of hers. 
Officers later went back to the victim's home and spoke with her. During the conversation, she asked the officers to step outside, most likely so her roommate wouldn't hear their conversation. Once outside, it was at this point that she advised the officers that she made this entire event up. She said that she was never grabbed by anyone and therefore was never assaulted. She admitted to having relationship issues with another guy and that this was what caused her to create this story. The officers explained to her that she would be charged with the offense of false report of a crime as a result. She agreed. On October 18, 2021, a warrant was put out for Amelia. She was booked for failure to maintain Lane and DUI. What do you think about this encounter? If you liked the video, consider subscribing and maybe like the video.